Hello, welcome to my channel. Today, it's gonna be a full day of meals, drinks, snacks, all low carb, diabetic, and keto friendly. This is gonna be the quickest intro you've probably ever seen, and that's because renovations next door, I am trying to film it between the hammering. Anything mentioned in today's video will be linked in the description box, as well as any discount codes that I may have and all my social media platforms. So come follow me on Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, and make sure you go ahead and subscribe while you're over here and hit that notification bell. Let's chat and let me show you what I'm eating today. There goes Mittens. Hi Mittens. I don't know where she's going in such a hurry this morning. Welcome to 8 a.m. chat with Christy. This is just going to be a blip of a second. I wanted you to know that again this morning I'm failing miserably at not having an energy drink. Most people are having their coffee at 8 a.m. I'm having an energy drink because I don't like hot coffee. I am skipping breakfast this morning because I'm having blood sugar issues as usual. Got up first thing this morning and before I even roll out of bed, scan my arm and I was at 111, which I'm fine with. My doctor says he wants me to have a fasting blood sugar in the mornings of under 120. So I got up and I took 10 units of Traceba at seven o'clock. That's my go-to dosage. And by the time I scanned my arm again, I had the up arrow and I was at 136. So. As soon as I get up out of bed, my blood sugar shoots up. I went ahead and took a couple of units of fast acting insulin, hopefully to bring that down. So let's just go ahead and check it. It's been exactly an hour since I took my Humalog. I took two units and I am still at 127. It says I'm stable, so at least I'm not climbing anymore. Remember our neighbors are renovating their house and the workers show up bright and early. Quincy's not happy. So anyways, getting ready to get in the shower and clean up. I've got some things that I need to get done today. And since my blood sugar was a little eh, all over the place, I just went ahead and took the two units of Humalog. I'm rambling. I'm all over the place. But the reason that I wanted to jump on this morning was please make sure you stick around till the snack and chat or whatever I end up doing today because I got to show you something what came in this little box right here. It may be a little box, but let me tell you, this thing is heavy. Do you know what that means? Mm-hmm. Spoiler. It's an award. Can you see that the sun is coming up, shining right in my face? I also want to talk about, if you're watching this, the week of the 12th, I'm doing a meetup. Don't go anywhere. I got stuff to tell you, food to show you. I'll see you in a sec. It's almost nine o'clock and guess what I forgot? Fill up my water bottle and get started with that today. I'm not gonna put a ton of pressure on myself, but my plan is to get in this one container of water over the course of the day. I have managed to take my shower. I'm getting ready to go dry my hair. It's pretty much already dry itself. It doesn't need much help from me. Now that it's short, it dries quick. As many of you know, I'm not a doctor and I am no beauty guru. I'm just over here hanging out and I'm sharing my journey with you all. And when I find a good product, whether it is keto or not, I feel the need to share it. Let me just say, you need this. If you have issues with your skin, just feeling rough, that you feel the texture on it, it's not nearly as smooth as it used to be, this is gonna be your new best friend. L'Oreal Paris, fragrance-free, very important. Revita Lift, Derm Intensive, 3.5% pure glycolic acid cleansing gel. This is gonna help resurface for smoother, brighter skin. This is a massive container, it's 6.7 fluid ounces. I ordered it from Amazon. It's going to be linked below. I don't use this every day. Just when I jump in the shower, I put this on my face. I massage it in. I let it sit for just a few seconds and then I rinse it off and my skin has never been so smooth in my entire life. Visible results. Impurities are removed. Skin feels hydrated. Skin is resurfaced, appears smoother, 
and brighter. It says you can use it daily. I just don't feel the need to do that. It's not that expensive. I feel like it's a great deal for what you're getting. I'm going to link it in the description box. You know how that goes, but I've been extremely impressed with this stuff. Okay, now I'm going to go dry my hair. Time flies. I've been sitting outside with the pets today, getting some work done and realized it's time for lunch. Let's see what I can throw together. I fixed a taco salad. Now I'm using chicken in this instead of beef. I picked these steak and chicken breast sandwich steaks up at Publix. This is the nine ounce package. There's six in here. There's your nutritional information. You've got six servings per container, 40 calories, 0.5 fat, less than one carb and eight protein. These are just strips of thinly sliced chicken. I throw them in a pan on the stove, add taco seasonings or whatever I wanna season them with, and then cook them up. In the bowl, I added shredded lettuce, shredded cheese. I also added some of the Mateo's salsa, sriracha, jalapenos, and sour cream. I literally threw this meal together in about five minutes. To drink, still working on my bottle of water. Let's do the snacking chat today. This is going to be my snack. Have you guys seen it? I think this came in the keto crate. This is a snack mix. There's what the packaging looks like. This entire package is going to have five grams of net carbs. Going to have cheese bites in it. Think moon cheese, cashews, pecans, and this one is the keto medley. Ingredients also look really good. Gluten-free, 100% real cheese, kosher, built-in crunch, preservative free, 1.5 ounces, 270 calories, 24 fat, seven total carbs, two dietary fiber, and nine protein. These are delicious. I will be ordering more of them because I like the whole convenience factor of being able to just to throw these in a bag, take them to the movies, have them on hand. And I like prepackaged foods like this because it helps me with portion control. I don't know if they have other flavors than just this one. I need to, I guess, look into it. Maybe they have like a variety pack. If I find anything or if they have different flavors other than this one, then I'll put them down below so you can go check them out too. And I'm having my water to drink. Okay. I have two important things that I want to talk about during the snack and chat. I do want to, you know, share this honorable mention. Kerrigan, got engaged recently. We have already started wedding planning. She has already picked a date. There's lots going on behind the scenes already. I will be sharing more of that information, hopefully with her in the video with me in future videos and check out all of my upcoming what I eat in a day videos because it's going to be lots of wedding details. First thing I do want to discuss is this is something I've been wanting to do for over two years at this point, and I had already started planning in early 2020, and that was monthly meetups. So there's lots of people that are doing keto and low carb that follow me over here, that hang out with me, that I talk to regularly on YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, and I was wanting to do monthly meetups so that we could get together, chit chat, talk about new products, just get together and hang out. And now that things have finally started settling down, I am going to start that up. The first little local meetup is going to be actually this week. It's going to be this coming Thursday, and that is going to be May 12th. I'm thinking Buffalo Wild Wings in Johnson City, Tennessee at about six o'clock. Now, the time, the dates, the place, all of that is going to change monthly, but I do want to start something like this. I want to get this sense of community and be able to meet you guys and hang out. Most of you know that Chris, my husband, does travel for work, and when he is out of town and we do go visit him, we will schedule those meetups for those places. Next month's June's will be in upstate New 
New York. So the one coming up this Thursday, I will try to put some more information down in the description box. Plus there's tons over on the Facebook group, but this is the plan. Monthly meetups for the locals, planning something bigger coming soon. The second thing I wanna talk about is what's in this box? In case you don't know, this past weekend, the Metabolic Health Summit was held in California. It's where lots of medical professionals, keto creators, companies get together and they discuss, obviously, metabolic things, health journeys, new information, and meet some of your favorite people, try out products, all that good stuff. They also had some awards. They had a gala on Saturday, this past Saturday. Some of the categories, there were only like a handful, was like top podcaster, top keto educator, and then this one. From the Metabolic Health Summit and ketogenic.com, this is one of the keto awards for 2022, making positivity louder. Winner, Christy Davis. Uh, you probably can't see too good because it is clear. I'm shocked amazed. I bawled like a baby. Of course, I didn't make it to the summit because we had family plans with Kerrigan getting engaged. And of course, it was Mother's Day. I didn't want to leave my children. I spent the entire day with them. The last two years has just been a roller coaster. 2020, I won Keto Influencer of the Year. And then this year, making positivity louder. I really don't feel like I'm out here doing anything special. I just feel like like I'm sharing my journey and I am lucky enough to have all of you guys along with me. I just hope that I, I am in some way helping, letting you know that it's okay. Your journey does not have to be perfect. Nobody's is. Do what works for you, whether it's keto, low carb, Atkins, standard American diet, exercise, calorie deficit. I don't care. I just think that we all need to find what works for us, not be so hard on ourselves, be happy, be kind, support one another. And again, if along the way I'm allowed to be a part of your journey, I truly, truly appreciate you letting me be a part of that. So I just wanted to share this with you, let you know that I appreciate everyone that did vote for me. I feel like I am rambling on and on and on. I'm gonna go in the house <laughs> because it's getting louder out here. They're starting to work right here beside the house. So I'm gonna go in and hang out with Kerrigan for a little while, but I'll see you at the next meal. Do I even wanna know what you two are up to? He's, it's killing him being this close to her. Yep, there we go. She's so patient with him. I don't know what he wants. I swear I think she's grabbing back at him. I don't know how she does it. If I was Mira, I'd already bopped him. They're like having two children. It, it's like having toddlers all the time. Simple meal tonight for dinner. This is the rice cauliflower risotto medley that I pick up at Walmart. You can get it pretty much at any grocery store. I just steam it in the bag. Shrimp is from Sam's Club. All I'm gonna do is make a really quick Alfredo sauce. In a pan, I'm going to melt some butter, add some of the minced garlic, which I pick up at Aldi, add in some heavy whipping cream, bring all of that to a boil, then I will sprinkle in some parmesan cheese as far as the shrimp goes all i do is just steam that in butter throw it all together and that's how quick you can have a meal that's keto and low carb it's been about two hours and i feel like i need something sweet i'm calling these keto bonbons i've already posted them over on tiktok i'll link the tiktok below if you want to go ahead and watch that and get this recipe but it is coming to a video really soon be warned these are dangerous i want to eat the entire container but i'm only gonna have one 
thanks for watching. I hope every one of you have an amazing day and I will see you next time. Bye.